Whoa, what? All right. So we're getting into it. As you can see, this time I will talk. So, my baby is latched. He has a good form. I like to pull him up sometimes on top of my belly since with the postpartum and stuff it's pulling at say my uterus and it hurts so i find that holding him up and having something supportive on my back as you can see i got pillows so that it gives me some support because you can definitely feel the pressure I will have my legs up, but I'm just doing a quick little session because he decided that he wants to eat before I go and take a shower. So also, we're going to get into Oh, he put the peace sign up. <laughs> so um, also, I will be doing breast, uh, breast pumping videos. And my bad, it was pancakes. So... I just ate pancakes. But anyway, we'll be doing a breast um, pumping video about pumping. I will. Well, you'll see the products I will be using. Um, because now I started pumping because I have to pump a lot. My boobs produce a bunch of milk, which is awesome. I'm not complaining. I do also use the milk for my face. And I occasionally drink it. It's good for you, though. A lot of people are like, ew, oh, that's nasty. Why would you do that? I use the milk for my face. I use the milk for his face. I use the milk for my other kid's face. As you can hear him, he is smacking. So I just lift the boob up, lift him up. Now that he has hold, hold on. Now that he has hold of it, he is content. Sometimes he pops off, but you just pop him right back on. <laughs> so right now it's actually hurting me. Like sometimes I can't breathe, I can't talk. Or if I do talk, it's very like a whisper, like nothing comes out. This takes a lot out of you. Like with my other children, it wasn't, I wasn't in this much pain. But this is my fifth and last. Let's make that clear. Um, with this one, yeah. I, this is almost, well, he's five days old. And it's hard. It's really hard. Like, I can't walk. I feel like I need a cane everywhere. I'm on, I use a chair to get around. That's how bad the pain is. Um, and I don't like to take the medicine because we know medicine is man-made and it's not good for you. So I drink tea. I drink herbal teas. And when I'm drinking the tea, if I don't have my heating pad out, I will put the heating pad. I mean, I will put the teacup while it's warm on my belly. And that takes away from the cramping. And also, um, some people use a brace, and it's and it like holds the stomach up, and it relieves pressure off of you. Is what what I was told. I haven't tried it yet, but um, I'm thinking about trying that because this pain is really, really unbearable. Sometimes it's basically contractions all over again, and it's whew, it hurts. I can handle it, but it hurts. So right now he has did a drink move and decided to pass out so what i'm going to do is close up the shop as you can see him that's his pacifier in my shirt and what i'll have to do is if you watch my other videos take them oh that was a little caught me off guard take them always gotta wipe on his little thing is right here wipe his little mouth look he's mad now so when he does this i always move him because i know he's not finished eating he usually eats for like 10 minutes so this is what i'm gonna do this right here let's see all right all right mr fusser what's wrong huh so sometimes he just wants a little sip and for me to rock him yes i he has to like cross his legs. I gotta hold him in my hand. And his body just has to be like limp. But it has to be in the middle of the chest. If you put him to the side anywhere else, 
He's he's a, a little picky one. And also, when he's fussy, I put him in my shirt. So I noticed that sticking to him in my shirt helps. He hates being swaddled. First baby that I have who doesn't enjoy being swaddled, which is funny. So what I would do is take him just, like right now he's okay. See, this is what he wants. So what I'm going to do is lean him back, take my shirt. We're going to see if he gets hungry again first before stopping. Stick him in the shirt. And this is how he will stay. Look at his face. He has milk on the face. <laughs> so adorable. And, yeah, so right now, he's, he's playing possum. He's not really going to nap. As soon as I lay him down, he's going to cut a fuss. So let's see, we'll keep this video rolling. And I'm gonna actually change him because he just woke up from a nap. I'm gonna change him, and then you're gonna see that he will want to get back onto the booby. And like I said, stay tuned. I will have other videos that I will be posting. I will be talking about his circumcision. Um, again, I will be doing, I'm sorry, I'm trying to crop this. Um, I will be talking about his circumcision. I will be doing will be doing uh, breast feet uh, pumping videos because I definitely have to pump a lot and storing. I'm gonna show you guys how to properly pump and store so the nipple is not getting raw or anything like that. And if it is, I can tell you the proper care so that you know it won't be raw because that hurts. It's it's but I enjoy breastfeeding. To the fullest but when it hurts you don't want anything near there and and also you don't want a baby that's you know going to be hungry though so uh, oh boy one second so right now he's back to eating i had to put him in his blanket he was getting fussy i did change them i did change him um excuse me and who oh, excuse me, I'm sleepy. Did his little routine or whatever. As you can see, he is still up. Oh, you can hear the sucker going. So what you would do, see his head is looking for it. Take, lift the booby up, and apply it to the little baby lips. No, I won't be all up on the camera. Try not to. But. Here he is. Look, he's covering himself. He's like, get out of here. Whoops. Uh-uh. So sometimes he does just pull off like that. A lot of times. which I call it finishing off. So I'm pretty sure that he's done now. I changed him. I put some clothes on him. Let him take a nap while I go do what I need to do. See, so you put the piece side up. He said, that's it, ma. It's done. Let it be. Right this lady go. But, so, to finish it off all the time now with this baby I've learned, I have to. I don't like to disturb him, but I have to pick him up. He's a little butt. Look at how he ends him. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. He don't want to be moved. Okay, okay. Look. And just make him feel lovely. As you can see, I grabbed his little feet. And he knows this is his mama. So he <laughs> sounds like he's snoring. But I got my other one behind me screaming. But yes, this is how all of our breastfeeding sessions go. Whether it's two minutes he's on the nipple or not, I have to ball the feet up in the hands, hold them, or stick them in my shirt, have them in the middle of the chest, of the breast, and he's good to go. So, 
again stay tuned guys i will be back with breast pumping videos and more on breastfeeding of course the breast um feeding videos will be daily so just stay tuned um like comment subscribe and keep supporting i really appreciate everyone thank you guys for tuning in and watching my channel <laughs> we'll be back with the sweeties <laughs>